Uh, no friends, the good news is that Indian Railway has confirmed that they are planning to ACify even the general category of uh, bogies in Indian Railways. You know, I never understood why we need three classes. If you actually visit any other country, there is uh, two classes, which is class A and class B uh, in the train travel. And India being such a big country and uh, Indian Railways is the world largest employers in the world. And we are still running three classes. I think this is because of the colonial era hangover. And uh, finally, the Indian Railways is getting out of this hangover. They are going to essentially remove the, uh, the general category, non-AC category out completely. And they will have only uh, two categories, which is AC upper class and AC lower class, especially in the long term uh, journeys. And as you know, friends, India is such a big uh, country for any long journey, the uh, reservation is compulsory. So the Indian Railway's logic is that since most of the passengers are traveling on a compulsory ticket, on a confirmed ticket, that means each one of these guys, even though they are traveling in a general category, they will uh, have a seat reserved for them, especially for a long distance journey. And uh, uh, you know uh, why they should not uh, travel in comfort. So I think the uh, decision is very good. I personally feel very happy that even for the general category, the entire train will be uh, AC fired and uh, people who cannot afford to buy AC class uh, ticket can also travel in AC in a general category, general compartment. So we'll have to see how these uh, uh, bogies will be uh, implemented, these new AC class will be implemented, which is a general category class. And uh, I think there is a trial going on for these general category chair car and the bogies are being manufactured out of Kapoorthala based bogie manufacturing plant. So uh, friends, I think this is a great move. Uh, and finally, the Indian Railways is getting out of these C class system, which we have inherited from the British Raj, where there was first class, second class and third class. So we should not actually call anything third class when uh, people are traveling in it, especially. So I think this is a great move. Do let me know, do write in uh, with your comments and also let me know what you think about this uh, initiative by Indian Railways. Do you think it is good to uh, provide AC services even in the general class? Or if you don't agree with this, do write in in either, either case. And I will say goodbye for today only to meet you in the next one.